is only war. Alright, what's up gents? We're at Stomping Grounds today on a Monday night game. We're playing Craig. What's up, Craig? Hey. I'd like to show off our new uh, jerseys. They're pretty sick. That dude, that blue and purple stands out so much. Yeah, they do. It looks so much cooler. All right, so we got uh, Night Lords today versus Botan. Uh, we're testing uh, out a rematch game. Uh, you played my Black Legion last time? I did. All right, so we played Black Legion. Uh, it was definitely a good game. He's testing it out again. He didn't change up the list at all, but we are running fucking Night Lords, so it's completely different. We'll go over the list in a little bit. We got Bandit Sanctuaries. Uh, this mission is a pain in the ass for a lot of armies, especially Botan that can't really pre-game move. This is definitely a great practice uh, for Craig. We got five objectives, one, uh, three in the center, two in our deployment zones. Deployment zone is what, 10 inches up? Correct. 12, 10? 10 inches from the sides. 10 inches from the sides, okay. Uh, and then the secondary is if you control the center, you get two points. If you kill a unit from the uh, center, you get two points? Mm -hmm. To a total of three if you do both? Yes. Or, okay, cool, so if you do both, you get three points. Uh, my secondaries, we already went over them, uh, is going to be Long War, Warp Ritual, and Battlefield Data, which will be the first time I'm doing that, so hopefully I remember. Uh, and he's taken Assassinate, Kill Shit, and Prospects of the Wealth? Yes. Of the Wealth, okay. What is that one? So, uh, I can start an action at the end of my movement phase with either an infantry unit or a bike unit. Uh, it completes at the end of the turn. Uh, when it completes, it scores three points, and that, uh, that objective is said to be uh, prospective. I roll a d6, I get plus one if the unit has had the scanner keyword, so the upgrade. Um, if I get a six or more uh, at, for this at the end of the game, if I still control one of those, uh, well, those rich deposits, I get an extra three victory points. Uh, and can, do you have a, a thing where you can shoot and do an action? I have a thing where I can uh, do anything other than shoot and charge and do an action. So what is that? Weird. Okay. So uh, can you shoot the, uh, and do an action or no? The character, the Forge Master, can shoot and do an action. Well, as long as he has the uh, his assistant with the uh, the apron on, he can do that. <laughs> okay, got it. Uh, cool. So we we'll back and talk about the lists. All right. So today we got the Night Lords. Uh, we have leading it off our Disco Lord. He's got the Flames of Spite, Zeech, uh, and. That's it. <laughs> Dude, dude's insane in combat. And then we got uh, Demon Prince. So Demon Prince is rocking the Lord of Terror. Uh, and also he's Slanesh, so he has the Elixir for the Relic. Um, and then we have a Master Possession. Master Possession is uh, plus one strength and toughness and bring a guy back. He doesn't have a mark on him, so we can bring the uh, demons in from Deep Strike. Uh, we have a Master of Execution. He has the Night Lord's uh, gets to turn one roll into a six, uh, as well as the pistol relic, uh, which is super deadly, does two mortal wounds on the hit, four shots, strength, or range 18, uh, and also explodes after turn two. Uh, then we have a demon uh, HQ, uh, she's just the basic uh, Slanesh demon character who is bringing the one power for demons that if you roll a seven plus, you roll six dice on a Five plus, they take a mortal wound, and every mortal wound they take is minus one to the leadership. Cumulative, which is great. We are rocking a Heldrake today. Uh, we're trying to, you know, obviously run him out before ninth edition is over. Uh, we have two units of possessed. They're just basic possessed. They bring the minus one leadership with the Night Lords uh, leadership or We have a Bellfire Tome Legionnaire unit for our crown because we are bringing the crown in today. Uh, we have a unit of Rubric Marines. They are Zinch as well as the Warp Time. Unit of Raptors, just basic uh, Raptors for some secondaries. Uh, Cultus, a uh, unit of 10 Demonettes, and two units of six Fiends. Now these guys get to combi with the Night Lord's trait for the minus one leadership and minus one combat attrition tests. So anything basically leadership nine or below, we're gonna get plus one to our wounds for the entire army in melee. All right, Craig, what do we got today? All right, today I got my Old Faithful Ursers. Uh, we have a uh, Forge Master, has a Warlord trait so that it always uh, heals a vehicle for four wounds. A uh, vehicle unit within six inches, when they can fail a save, I can make the damage characteristic zero. He can complete an action and shoot. And uh, an unmodified six to wound with the, uh, the Forge Master model gets converted into mortal wounds and the uh, uh, attack sequence ends. We've got the Iron Hair Champion, he has Exactor and Warrior Lord. So that means that uh, he has no uh, negative modifier to hit with his, his hammer. 
Uh, does D3 plus 3 uh, wounds uh, when it attacks. On an unmodified 6 to hit, uh, it does D3 plus 3 mortal wounds and the sequence ends. Uh, and he ignores wound caps and uh, gets to rebuild a wound. We have a unit of 10 hearth guard. The, the Thane has a hammer, the, uh, or the Hesser. The Hesser has a relic that lets the unit sight to sight teleport uh, once per game for free. And also, uh, any uh, enemy units uh, can't uh, deploy within 12 inches of the unit. We have uh, five uh, Thunderkin with Graf. We have two squads of six uh, bikes with all of the goodies, including the rotary cannons. Uh, I use them because they have a longer range and because I'm not uh, Ymir, uh, they don't really get any benefit from having team weapons. Uh, we've got two land fortresses. Uh, they both have a uh, heavy conversion beamer. They have bolt cannons and an auto cannon. And the nice thing about them is that they're uh, T9 and uh, ignore, uh, ignore light cover. And then, of course, the two bike squads and the two land fortresses can Osmex scan for two uh, CP, so be careful. All right, cool. So let's see who sets up first. I got a two. I got a six. All right, you want me to set up? Yeah, I want you to All set up. All right, first. so I think with this game, we're going to have uh, the Flamer dudes uh, in reserves. Mm -hmm. uh, they are... So Osmex scan for you are the bikes and the tanks. Correct. Okay, so the bikes and the tanks can shoot within 12. Mm -hmm. Got it. Uh, but nobody else. Nobody else. Okay. So we're going to put uh, the two... We're going to put the two demonettes, or one demonette in deep strike. Mm -hmm. These two fiends in deep strike. Mm -hmm. uh, and we're going to put that... Oh, and obviously the flyer has to be in deep strike. Mm -hmm. And I think I'm going to start the rubrics on the field. Okay. So just all these three deep strike, mm -hmm. and that guy in deep strike. I'm gonna put the Thunderkin in strategic reserves, and everybody else is starting with you. Got it. Cool. So we're back after deployment. All right. Cool. So deployment. I did change it up. I put uh, those guys in deep strike as well as those guys in reserves because uh, I forgot we are doing some actions that we've never done before, and we kind of need them. So we got a. Uh, these guys with the Master Possession, uh, Demon Prince with the Disco Lord, and everybody else over here. Uh, then we have the Legionnaires in cover over there. Uh, and then we got basically a big brick in the center with some bikes and bikes on both sides. So let's see who goes first. Ba -ba. I got two. I got a five. All right, so it looks like Botan is going first. We'll be back after movement turn one. All right, so turn one, moved everybody up, moved over. Very incredibly action packed turn. Did the action. Just towed. Did the action, towed in onto this objective. Uh, gave this unit the plus one ballistic skill from the Forge Master, just in case. Scooch these guys over. Basically, my goal is uh, I know that whatever comes out of that building is going to hurt me horribly. <laughs> so I just need to be prepared to be able to shoot something that comes over and uh, keep my bikes from getting slapped to hell. Yep. We very, very exciting and <laughs> That was quick. It took turn. maybe two minutes. Yeah, was, uh, yeah. So yeah, we'll be back after movement turn, bottom one. All right, cool. So again, quick turn one. Uh, everybody, these guys scooted up to the action. Uh, these guys ran onto that objective and that objective uh, to take over that for long war, so that'll give me two points. Uh, these guys did the action over here. He stayed on the objective over here. They all scooted up. This uh, Demon Prince ran uh, to the center over there. Uh, executioners against the wall, and then these guys ran as far forward to try and stay out of line of sight as they best they can. Let's go to second phase. We're going to uh, do four up in one save. Goes off on a nine. Nice. Uh, so we're going to put that on the rubrics. Uh, we're going to do a smite. Smite goes off on a ten onto the big guy. Give me one. Uh, we're going to do the demon weapon over here. Uh, fails, and then we're going to. Uh, I think that's all my stickers. Oh, over here. So we're going to do plus one strength to toughness. Uh, six. I think that fails. All right, cool. So it actually goes off on a six because so we're going to put the plus one toughness on this unit. So they have the four pinball and plus one toughness, um, and that's it. So we're going to go shooting. Uh, we just have one. Uh, we can put some flamers into there. Uh, I think only one, two, three can see him. Yeah. So we got one, two, three. No, let me see. Yep, three. Okay. Uh, so 
we got 6, 10, 11, plus 9. Okay, cool. So plus 6, not 9. Uh, we need 6s. So here's some random hot shots and good talk. All right, cool. So then we got uh, the big flame over here. Uh, 10, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and then actually 2. 2d3, so uh, so five. Five. Two, four, five, plus two. Uh, and then strength is six, so five. Six. Give me two minus three minus two. Alright, so three, three up. Good. Alright, uh, that's me. So I got two for uh, controlling the center. I got two for uh, long war. Uh, and I got one tally for the uh, quarter over here for battlefield data. And Warp Ritual, we didn't get to do yet. So, we'll be back after movement, turn two. What are you doing, Craig? Right, right now. What are you I'm, doing? I'm using the site to site teleport strategy. Stop it. To get into your backfield and do horrible, terrible, no good things to your models. Sweet. Yeah. All right, so there goes uh, that guy. <laughs> Hopefully I can kill them, because they're the bigger, juicier target than he is. Although I will be able to shoot him with the, uh, the little gun, so that's probably what I'm going to do. Alright, so other than that, I took this uh, land fortress up to draw a line of sight onto that back squad. I learned my lesson this time. I really need to stop that uh, CP generation. All right. I moved this one over in such a manner to make it really difficult for or hit for Derek to be able to charge me through. Mm -hmm. Again, another lesson to learn in protecting your soft characters. <laughs> Got a bunch of these guys up. They're gonna try to um, take some pot shots over there, but mostly just protect this character from the back. Yep. Um, I healed up this uh, one wound. I kept the the, the Iron Here champion in the in the uh, the hole because I don't think we'll be, I'm gonna be able to blow through all ten of these Rubik Marines with Top of Five and Four of One will save. So right now my goal is to uh, to wait wait his turn. He can kill one of the characters when he gets down, but if, he, if I do it too soon, he'll just get shot by the uh, Lord Discord or something, and he'll die because he only has six moves. I move this buck these uh, bikes up to try to get three auto cannon shots out wherever they need to, and then I took the sight to sight teleport over here to uh, to do horrible horrible things to the possessed and the master of executions. Sweet. Take okay. it away. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, activate that big unit over there. Mm -hmm. I'm going to spend one CP, bring me down to three, to bring me on the four, to uh, reroll hit rolls Send against uh, units that have judgment tokens. And since everybody had judgment tokens, I'll just get the reroll. Got it. So I'm going to take the, the grenade launchers, and they're all going to go into the Master of Executions, which is 10d6 shots. And then I'm going to take the uh, the Volkite and I'm going to put that into the Possessed. Got it. Uh, we'll spend one CP for the Possessed. So they're just minus one to uh, hit. Okay. So I need fours. Four sixes of more wounds. That doesn't count. I kind of want to get this through, so I'm going to actually take these these hits and not get too greedy. Strength is five, so I need force. Yep. So I need ten two up saves and uh, seven mortal wounds. All right, so ten two ups, uh, one, and then how many mortals? Seven. So one, two, three, so two and a quarter. Alrighty. <clears throat> Convenient. 
10 dice, 10 d6 shots of the Master of Executions. Are these mortals as well? No, no mortals here. Just a stupid amount of shots. <laughs> oh, there's d6. d6, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a lot. There's a lot. Uh, so, AP what? AP zero. So you're going to need two is in the string four. Uh, so uh, 12, 17, 20, 30, 40, 52. All right, so strength four? Strength four. All right, fours. That's a lot of sixes, Craig. That's a lot of sixes. Thankfully, the sixes don't do anything extra. But yeah. <laughs> how many? How many we got? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Uh, three, two, up, James. Ah. There we go. There's, there we go. there's four. There's four. And. Uh, Uh, then I'll shoot uh, the squad at them, at the, uh, at the Zest. I only have three that can see. Seems good. Only one of which, none of which is a uh, turret, uh, so that's, uh, that's good for you. More good for you than it is for me. So uh, you have one guy with one wound left, so I'm going to start with the four shotguns. So strike five, AP one, one damage. Still minus one, correct? Yes. Right. And, uh, give me uh, three AP one, no cover. Three. Uh, good. Yes. Five shots and two, three, two, one at AP two. Fours. And these are strength seven. So give me five AP two. No cover. Right. Five AP two, so fives. Two damage. So one dies, two dies. One left. Ba -ba. Cool. What else? Alright, so we're gonna take uh, this guy. Everything is going into those far uh yeah, I guess. Uh so the beam is gonna end up dissecting uh, this model, but you'll only be hit once we hit. So first, to do the conversion beamer. I really want to make sure that you die. So it'll be two hits on the back squad and one hit on this front squad. So the back squad, uh, I need two is because of strength nine. It'll be two at AP three. And okay. on the front one, uh, one and four and one. All right, so two AP three forms. Uh, one dies. Damage, right? Is a lot. Uh, damage is four. Okay. Also, no cover. Okay. And then uh, one. So, uh, so this guy. Uh, do you, do you forget it's rule? No, I did forget it's rule. Yeah, you did. I did. So four <laughs> component was it? Yes. Um, and then one four. Good. All right. And then I'm done on him. Yeah. So basically, everything within nine inches now gets a uh, a four pinball. Nice. Yeah. And then next turn it'll be 12, and then turn after that it'll be 15, and then turn after that it'll be 18, I think. Something like nice. that. It's crazy. I'm early together at once because... Um, What's all this? Uh, this is the rest of this gun. Oh, into the... Into okay. the, the Legionnaires. I do the other gun first because it's complicated. So I need twos, and uh, six to go right through it. And then... Threes. Go ahead and give me 10 at AP2. So cover or no cover? Uh, no cover, but it wouldn't matter. Damage? Anyway. Two. Uh, one, two, three die, four die. Craig wants to make a really quick game. <laughs> yeah, I guess I do. <laughs> I don't want you to have too many, too many CP uh, because it's mostly bad for me.
All right, so six AP what? AP two. Two, four, six, and everything in Norse cover, right? Right. God, that's so good. All right, so force. Ah. All okay, right, so guys. ignore the first one. Nobody dies. Right. Yay. Yay. <laughs> you forget all my oh, fucking rules. I'm like, I'm like, what happened? What do they have? What are they? This is the worst thing that I, 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 I know this and remember this. It's like he plays chaos too. It's like I play chaos too. Oh this my god. Bad. Okay. All right. So I forgot the. Uh, I, I had another moment of sadness where I forgot the mark of Zinch entirely. So now I'm going to shoot the, uh, the 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 18 shots at one damage. I mean, they're all two damage, right? No. No, those ones you just shot. Ones I just shot are the two damage ones. Because I was like, yeah, I'll just start bodying things, and it's the ones that matter. All right, so I've got 18 shots, strength six, AP two, one damage. Uh, four uh, so everything in your army ignores cover, right? Besides those guys over there? Besides those guys over there, yeah. Got it. Ignores the light. And the, uh, the suit guys that I haven't brought in yet uh, ignore dense. So I need uh, fours, strength six. So remember this is the second time. Uh, eight and eight P minus two, one damage. All right, two, four, six, eight. This will be three ups because I get plus one in my save. All right. And so one, one damage. Mm -hmm. Got it. Got it. I'll put that back in. Not nothing else. All right. That's eight. That's it. Yeah, why not? Because he can put everything into them. Cool. This is the same target. Point is, alright, so... The tip was 5, so okay, so this won't... T5 minus 1 to 1. So I need 3s. Nothing goes right through. Uh, so I'll need four signals. Wow, all right. So uh, three minus two. Two damage. Yeah. Uh, three die. All right. All right, so uh, I'm going to shoot the... Uh, the beamer. I'm going to spend one CP. Uh, so one of these will automatically hit. And then uh, I need a four to wound. Yeah. Because strength nine uh, minus one. Nope, fell. All right. I thought you had more shots. That was literally the only shot? That was the only shot. Oh, do you mind if I take another guy off? Oh, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> I thought you had a lot more shots coming in. Oh, no. All right, so the way I placed them, uh, I couldn't take anything else but those three, uh, because then everybody else would die. So, yeah, we're going to let those, those three go over there. Yep. What else? Uh, that is uh, shot, shot, has no more shots, shot. That'll be it for the turn. Cool. So what'd you get? All right, so I have uh, a tally, a no prisoners tally of 28 right now, so I have to shoot for that. I had, I killed a character, took a three for assassination. I did not uh, get to start prospects of Wolf's this turn. And uh, I did not get uh, secure the sanctuaries. Cool, so for me, I'll hold two. Uh, you will need to do a uh, morale check on those when you're Okay, so lost four, nine, eight, seven, six, five. All right, so six they run. Don't run. Yay. Yep, we're good. All right, cool. So they're good. Uh, we're back after movement turn two. All right, so we want these guys on to try and block them from moving. Uh, he does have a two CP strat. We can literally just pick him up again, which is fucking crazy. Um, he came down in hover mode. Uh, no, not hover mode, in the shooting mode. I guess I should come in hover mode because he's probably going to die anyway next turn. Nah, fuck it. We'll stay, we'll stay in the play mode. Um, these guys did the action over here for the uh, secondary. This guy scooted up nine inches. These guys moved up 12. They came in deep strike. They came in deep strike, deep nets, and they came in deep strike. Um, or fiends. Yeah, fiends, fiends, and demon nets. And then uh, these guys moved up nine. These guys <coughs> advanced. Uh, Massive execution scooted up. She advanced, and then all these guys moved up. So I have no action over here anymore. So that's fun. 
Uh, we're going to do psychic phase. We're going to start off with uh, him. He's going to do diabolical strength. Mm -hmm. No, he has prescience. He's going to do prescience, uh, hopefully on those guys. Prescience goes off. So we're going to put that on... Fuck, it doesn't go off. Seven. So he fails. Uh, we're going to do his thing. He's going to do a uh, target on this thing. Mm -hmm. So he's just going to do a smite. Oh, I, I totally fucked that up. So smite fails. He has to do the action in the center. Mm -hmm. Warp time. So warp time went off. Sorry. That's kind of the whole point of moving him six inches. Right. So he warp times. He failed uh, the smite. And they're gonna do the four up uh, invault save on themselves. That fits. It's very productive. Uh, like I'm playing very nice. Okay. Right? Uh, so they're all done. Let's go to shooting. We're just gonna unload all the flamers into the bikes. We have uh, two CP, which is going to be uh, plus one to wound. So we have two, three, six guys in range. One, mm -hmm. two, three, four, five, six. So this would be 6, 11, 17, easy 19, 20. So 5, 10, 15, 20, plus 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Are you running on 4s? Do they have an invulnerable save? No. Alright, so just six up. Well, it'll be a five up. Sorry, five up. Alright, so give me three, six, nine, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen minus two, sir. Alright, fifteen five up saves. So one, two. Three bikes are dead, and one is uh, maimed. So he killed three bikes, and one of them is, is beat up. I left the two, got two bikes that had the uh, machine guns, and uh, the surge light left. Alright, uh, we're going to shoot this guy into this vehicle. Uh, we have four shots. Uh, four hits. Uh, strength is five. Give me two at minus two. Two at minus two, so threes. Good to go. Okay. Um, he's gonna put his flamers into the same guy. Mm -hmm. uh, three, four, five, six, two, four, six, five. Give me one minus two. One three up. And I'm good. Two. Oh, so knocks this guy off his ass. All right, he's gonna shoot the bikes. Okay. Uh, four shots. Strength six. Toughness five. Toughness five. So four minus two. So four five ups. Uh, so two failed. So uh, he dies, and he this guy takes two wounds, pointing him at you. Um, I believe that is all the shots. Go to charges. Uh, he is going to try and charge this guy. Okay, go for it. Oh, wow. That's a six. Are you within seven? You are not, so he fails. Uh, executioner is going to charge the uh, tank. You want that one next? So, how many shots do you have? Uh, two plus, um, I have 16 shots. Hitting on sixes. Hitting on sixes. Uh, what's the damage? Two. Uh, two of the shots have four damage. Uh, one of the shots, uh, the rest have, uh, uh, two damage. He doesn't have, does he have an invulnerable save from a relic? Nope. Okay. Alright, uh, we'll go into... Hmm. 
question. Well, he's gonna. He's not gonna charge. So he failed. He failed. And what is the right question? So if you charge, they're probably gonna die. He thinks he has an idea. We're gonna start with the fiends. Start with the fiends. Good choice. Or we'll start with the demoness. They're gonna try to roll nine. Okay. Uh, that's eight. Almost. Uh, then the fiends are gonna go. They're gonna roll nine. They got nine. So fiends are now off the objective, but they're Son on to the tank. Of a bitch. All right. Can't do anything about it. This is gonna be tight, though. Yeah. So like they rolled a nine. So mm -hmm. if I go, let's say six out to here. Uh huh. And I easily have four inches. Yeah. Just because I, I I accidentally left. Uh, yeah, space for this shit. He's gonna go right. there. Sounds good. This fiend is gonna hop up to here. And this fiend's gonna stay in the wall back here. Demon has failed. Uh, Demon Prince is going to... Possess gonna fly in. Mm -hmm. Possess gonna three. He's gonna just try and make room for the uh, Demon Prince. Okay. Do your plan. Three. Deep Prince is going to fly over. Mm hmm. Roll three. <laughs> Six. Yeah, it's the back of his base. Uh, does not get it. Back of his base would land right, right there. Yeah, right on top of the fiend. So I think I need seven. Yeah, it looks like it. Uh. Can't fit there, right? Because this right. little thingy. Because that little thingy. Alrighty. I have two. I mean, speed. also because he's too fat, but yeah, because of the thingy. Also. Leveraging something like that also unintentionally helped me in the Nova Open, <laughs> uh, because uh, my opponent was not able to fit uh, Cesaric his fat booty in this space. All right, I am gonna Overwatch. Her. All right now for the ease of speed because nothing nothing screwy can happen with this roll. I'm rolling everything at the same time. I hope to roll two sixes with the uh, the beams and I just get one six. So uh, one save at AP two from the auto cannon. Look at that. Right, see if he fails. He does. We will roll that one. I want one of these guys to get it. Right. That's a nine or eight. So I get to it. Uh, and then I blocked myself in over here, so he can't charge and she can't charge either because of the fiends. Right. So uh, yeah, we're gonna start. You're not really good in combat with them, so no, no, I'm not gonna interrupt. <laughs> we're gonna start with. Uh, He's got to stay on the objective to do that. I want to go with a nine. So we're going to start over here. Okay. So we're going to file in the back of his base. He's going to get over okay. to there. He's going to hop up to there. He's going to hop up to there. He's going to hop up to there. And he's going to stay right there. All right, so we got five guys. One, two, three, four, five. Hitting on uh, threes, uh, it's only turned on two. So what are the uh, the total uh, leadership modifiers right now? Uh, it's only two for the uh, Night Lords, and okay. plus one for the um, Demons. Okay, so, so I'm at plus one to one right now. Because that leadership six. Okay, yeah, so... Oh, right, I'm at two, leadership five, three, so yes. Four. Sounds good, so you need four to wound. Ah, it's hurtful. Good. So give me 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11 minus 2s. Alright, I got 11 dice right here. And I need 3s. Uh, let's see. That would be 10. So I'm going to turn this to 0 and take 8. That's from this guy? Correct. Is there a certain range? Or? That's 6 inches. From him? Anybody in oh, the unit. Oh, so the, oh, gotcha. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. That's cool. 
Yep. Uh, and then they'll finally add this. So I need to do a nine of this guy, which would probably get me that if I go three that way. Uh, yeah. Okay. So we're just gonna go three this way. Just so they're within the aura. Mm-hmm. And then he's gonna hop over the same thing. Stay in coherency. Sounds good. He's gonna hop up. He's gonna base. Keep that guy right there. Um, fiends can move in. So they're gonna pile in. Pile in. Pile in. Uh, they only have two attacks. Four, four, two guys in combat, so they're going on uh, threes. Uh, strength is five, so fives. Yep. Give me three minus two. That's hurtful. Uh, so All right, take two. Three, uh, three malefic. Uh, mm -hmm. Two malefic. Uh, two hits. Two hits. Fives. One minus three. So, uh, not that. Right. What's the damage? Three damage. Is it three? It's hurtful. Still alive. Still alive. Um, nobody else did anything. He's going to go. He's going to uh, pile in this way. Because uh -huh. um, if I stand on that deck, it literally doesn't matter. Right. But I could get you in combat. Now we're gonna try to protect this guy. Okay, so uh, hitting on this is a lot of attacks. Uh, two versus six. Mm -hmm. Hitting on twos. And I don't get any rerolls, and my warlord trade is all rerolls. <laughs> so hitting on twos. And then uh, this is plus one to wound. Mm -hmm. So I'm strength six. So five fours. Five fours, yep. Nice. Alright. So uh, two mortal wounds. Uh huh. Uh, and then two, four, five minus. Okay. This is so five four ups. <laughs> or alternatively, I'll just pass all of these. Let me. <laughs> I will. T I failed you. All right, these are three damage each. All right, so he'll go down to ten. Yes. So minus three, two damage. But if I'm going against a vehicle, it is plus one of the damage characters. Mm -hmm. uh, then he's got four extra attacks with his uh, oh, two mortal wounds on top of that. Right. I'm at eight. Uh, bladed limbs, hitting on twos. Sweet. Three Great. Hits. And then uh, strength is six, so this is not plus one. Uh, so fives. One and a mortal wound. So one minus two. So one three up. He's good. All right. And then so just a mortal. And then an extra four attacks. So I'll hit. And then uh, I need sixes. Same. <laughs> it, it's good if he can reroll wounds. Yep. Uh, and then he's gonna pile in and go kind of like one, two, three. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, so fought, fought, fought. Your attacks. We're gonna base him. Yeah, because then you can't get out there anyway. Right. Uh, so. Base them like that. That's me. Okay, so uh, first we'll do the uh, <coughs> do the clumsiness. Uh, we'll do the six. Do the D six attacks onto the uh, Lord Discordant. Two attacks. Nothing. And then we'll do the three attacks onto the uh, the, the uh, possessed. Give me one save, no AP. Good. Sweet. Right. So uh, we took over nothing. Mm -mm. Um, so I, I messed up. He should be literally like right here uh, to get me a lot of points. So Warp Ritual got me one tally. Uh, Battlefield data did that. Longmore uh, in fact, fucked up because of his placement. And then uh -huh. the holding the center, I fucked up because of his placement. So that was four. I'm just going to put four at the top uh, just mm -hmm. to see if it would have done anything. Right. Like that little fuck up is, uh, is huge. Mm -hmm. um, and then you hold one, two, mm -hmm. uh, which then is more. So his thing also got me four less points. So that's eight points I lost that turn because of 
that. Right. Uh, so you get 12. All right, and then um, leadership on those guys. I'm gonna spend my two. I'm gonna spend the two CP. Okay. Going down to one, and I'll auto pass because I know that they're screwed. Okay. Otherwise. Uh, so you go for two. Arguments. All right. What do we got? All right. So we've got. Uh, I have strung out these uh, these guys. I've uh, put him onto the table. I pulled back the uh, uh, the lion fortress. I healed up this one. He's at full. He's got BS two. Uh, what is it? He counts as his full bracket. It cost me one CP. It'll last until the start of my next command phase, which is really nice. I moved up the the bikes to get closer. Uh, so uh, and then I, I deployed here. The goal is going to be to kill him mm -hmm. and then unload whatever I can onto the uh, the Lotus Gordon and uh, hopefully get uh, this guy from here Too to gone. here in combat with the Demon Prince. Seems good. The idea is uh, killing him. Uh, he'll stay in combat with the, uh, the possessed. You now have two judgment tokens. So now a roll of a five or a six will automatically go. Uh, and uh, he'll be hitting on twos with every gun but the conversion of Uh He's got a gun, and he's also the closest to the Lord Discordant. They can shoot, and he actually has a gun. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to try to kill that, uh, that mastery possession. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to activate this one. I will... I'm going to put two of them onto the, uh, the possessed and three onto the hell drake. Yep. There'll be three damage onto each of them. They have d6 shots each. So two d6 onto the, uh, the possessed. Seven shots. That's actually not too bad. You need threes to hit. They ignore the uh, the penalty for dents, so it doesn't matter what's in between. And they're heavy weapons, no? Uh, no. Well, they are, but they ignore it. Got it. Strength is five. Of course. So I need three and EP three. Uh, do you ignore cover? I do not. Okay, so still fives. Uh, damage. And damage is three. Okay, yeah. So he dies. And then uh, 3d6 onto this turn. 11 shots. The force to hit because you're not in hover mode. No, I'm in hover mode. You are in hover mode? No, so? sorry, I'm not in hover mode. You're right. <laughs> so that's why I didn't charge. Yeah. Strength, top of seven. So five. So give me uh, 3 at AP3. Good, fail, fail. So six damage. So that works out. All right, so now everybody's going to shoot into him. Got it. Uh, first, we're going to go with this guy. Got it. So he's got three shots. He is BS2. What's the damage? Damage is uh, uh, three. Right, I'm going to spend one CP and another CP. So he is uh, minus one hit and minus one damage. All right, so threes to hit. Because he hits on twos normally. He hits on twos normally. And then uh, strength is... Yes. A value that is higher than... So I need fives and sixes to be more weeks. Uh, so one at 83. Yep. So two damage after the minus. Uh, ignores the first one. Ignores the first one. Nice. All right. So uh, then we'll put uh, these guys into it. Good. We're going to string them so they're within six so they could touch the point next turn. Minus one hit. Of course. And the So it goes. Probably hit. hit. And <laughs> strength. All right, Craig, how many hit? Four. Okay, hit. four out of how many? Out of six. Okay, got it. Just making sure. Yeah, I love instant good. replay. They should like have that in every game. Right? This is good. <laughs> this is good at me. So three wounds with my four. Oh, God. Okay, these actually all all wound. Okay, strength seven. So AP twos. Yes, they're strength seven. Okay. So three AP two, so fours. Uh, uh, damage? Two, uh, two down to one. All right, so take two. Plus one strength. 
And these are from these two bikes? Yeah, okay. still from the two bikes. And uh, we'll do the two bolt trap ones. <clears throat> okay, so four is hit, and I will pull out the threes this time. Before. Seven at AP two, one damage. Nice. Two, four, six, seven, four. Oops. I take one, two, three, four. So three left. All right, I'm going to activate uh, these guys next. I'll spend my my final CP because I really can't get this idiot. How many can see? Just three. Three. Yeah. Uh, so what will happen is. The three that can see will shoot at him. Mm -hmm. The three that can't see will shoot at him. Got it. All right, cool. So three into him, three, three into, into that. Him, three into them. So first we'll do the three into him. Got it. Uh, that includes the nine shots from the machine gun. Okay. So the machine laser. Uh, so I'll do, I'll do that first. Actually, I think we'll just do. This is a lot of guns. Well, not from Yeah. That. Yeah. All right, uh, minus one to hit. Minus one to hit. Uh, one, two, three. I'll do these two. The pink are strength seven, and the uh, the blue are strength six. So fours, re-rolling to hit. And I'm not going to get greedy with this because I really need to put these hits through. Picking up the threes, of course, because that would be cheating otherwise. I can't <laughs> imagine somebody doing that. <laughs> When they get through, this will actually work. That right, one, no, uh, well, you will not. The, the three does not. Uh, oh, the hit. Right to hit. I was thinking of one. All right, so the, the, the pink dice need threes, and the blue dice need fours. All minus two. All minus two. Two, and all four, six, eight. Dead. Oh, I didn't know there was that that much shit coming into him. Yeah. I think all he'll survive. No, not even close. Alrighty. All right. So four is coming in. Four DP two. Four two four DP two. So five. Uh, damage. No uh, damage is two. All right. Can you put two more on him? Then, actually, that is it. I don't have anything else. They are all out. So, I have just his guns. And what do I want to shoot with him? Well, I guess the only thing I can shoot is the reverse. So, uh, why the hell not? I'll give you some tube saves. Alright, cool shots. Into the rubrics. Yep. And then uh, no plus one toughness, so. What's the strength? Uh, strength is four. So fives. Three. AP what? Uh, AP is one, so two ups. So if you want to take one, they have to pass it. Yeah. Anything else? Oh, yeah, you got this thing. He's going to shoot in front of him. Uh, I don't have any CP, so we'll just do the two shots hitting on threes. Good, no. good talk. Good talk. <laughs> and these all hit on twos. Because they are not heavy. They are the hunter type. Fives will go right through. And then I need uh, threes for these. All right. Well, that was a good talk. This is uh, how many damage? Ten at AP two, two damage. Nice. Two, four, six, eight, right. ten. Uh, we got one, two in cover. Uh, 
Ignores the cover. Oh, just kidding. Fives. Uh, one dies, two dies, three dies, one takes two. Nice. Yeah, it's pretty good. Thing that I'm gonna do in this game, uh, he is going to charge your demon friends. Alright, let's measure that out. Alright, cool. So I don't have any CP, so he's charging both these guys, which I would fucking 100% overwatch, but I don't have it. Because uh, if I don't uh, charge them both, then I have to go out even wider. Oh, yes. That yes. So, uh, look at that, it failed. Alright, I don't, I don't have any CP to reroll, so I can't do anything about it. So the, uh, the hard guard are gonna charge those, uh, those cultists. There's my high roll. Yes. Nice. And next edition, we will not be able to do this. We will not be able to do this. This is actually a good teaching uh, measure. Yeah, uh, so this is the slingshot. But next time, if he rolls an 11, he'll have to come all the way around and end basically right there, base to base. Yeah. And then everybody else has to go base to base. So this stuff will not happen anymore. No. And the reason I'm doing this is because. I don't actually. Now, technically, you would have one guy on the objective because you have to finish off these guys mm -hmm. and then you can pile in this way because the closest yeah. target would be this guy. So you have to get enough tax on these guys for them to all die. Crap. And we probably should have measured like the first 14 inches to the objective mm -hmm. to see if it was even viable. Yeah, thankfully I'm overconfident. But, <laughs> but it's fine. Right. So you get, what, four or five guys? Yeah, five cool. guys. And then I will uh, right. bump them in. Alright, uh, that's going to be for charges. I don't have anything else. I will uh, activate them, of course. So I have five guys, so... One. Let me text each three. Three. Oh, shit. I got no CP to do anything. <laughs> Any threes. Sixes will kill a guy. I might have screwed myself with this. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to be able to do what I wanted to do. I just need one guy alive. <laughs> You're going to have a, one guy alive. Threes? What's strength? Eight? Strength Seven. is uh, five. All right, threes. So, uh, I whiffed. Five that? So five that. Yay! <laughs> right, we're going we're gonna to leave him out, but still closer to you, uh -huh. so that way you won't be able to get on the objective. Right. Lesson, right? Lesson. So we'll kill this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, and this guy getting out of combat. So he can choose if he wants to pile in this way uh, to get back to combat. Do, do you want to keep him in combat? I guess, yeah, might as well. Might as well. I'll get the, the, the free movement on these back guys. Yep. I'm not as concerned about your cool. ability to fight you back. Uh, this doesn't matter. We're going to go over there next, but I'm just going to move these guys because I don't want to move them again, so they're going to pile in. Uh, they have to end closer, so he's going to pile in this way. He's going to pile in this way. He's going to pile in this way. And he's going to pile in this way. Mm -hmm. uh, so then hopefully they'll then pile in this way again. Okay. Uh, oh, no, actually, I'm going to get my objective back. So I'm going to try and bring these guys back. So we're going to pile in this way. Like that. And then consolidate. Sorry, consolidate. He's going to pile in this way. I'm going to spend the one CP that I get to make them to get back on the objective to try and get a, a 12... I can't get a 12. Maybe I might get a 12, I don't know. We'll see if we can get a 12 or not. All right, so six from the two possessed, minus two. Oh boy. Oh uh, shit. Two. So four damage. He's got how many left? Three? All right, and then we'll pile in. That way and that way. Uh, we'll go with the fiends. They're gonna scooch up. So one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Uh, they're going to do four, four, and five. 
Hitting on threes. Miss, 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 miss. And then moving on fives. One minus two. Malefic. One. He lives! Alright, uh, so that thing is still in combat. That kind of sucks. Uh, pile in. Pile in. Alright, what'd you get? Alright, so. Again. Don't control the center. Assassinate. We did. I got another we, two for. I got another three for assassinating. I will get the two for uh, destroying an enemy unit that was really no, suspicious. Two. Uh, I got three for assassination, and I got another two points for no prisoners. Got it. All right, we'll just do that at the end. Cool. So we're back at the bottom turn three. All right, cool. So what do we do? A lot. Got to It's like forty chests right now. We got these guys come down to do the action over there. Uh, mm -hmm. These guys fell back from the tank over here. The possessed fell back to be within six of everything over here uh, and be on the objective. And then uh, these guys came in over, over here. These guys moved up over here to stay on the objective because I am going to die over here. I did bring back guys uh, to get this objective so I can get eight. Mm -hmm. That one model who wasn't on this objective would have got me 12. Uh, so I wrote that down just to kind of make sure that we can track that. He moved over six. Uh, he's not closest to this guy so, so I couldn't shoot him. Everybody else got him closest. Uh -huh. uh, and the demon prince is kind of just chill there. He does have a fight on death, right? He does have is a fight on death. Nope, you gotta spend a CP. CP. One CP. Okay. So one CP, you can fight on death, so you basically can't use the CP at all. So I have to try and shoot him in the shooting phase. Yep. Uh, or the smites. Um, he scooted over uh, to get like these guys in there. Mm -hmm. And that's, uh, that's me. So let's go to psychic phase. We're gonna do the warp ritual uh, right here. Goes off. Alrighty. That's my second warp ritual. Uh, we got a smite from the uh, from the this guy. So the smite goes off. D3 mm -hmm. and your dude. Take three. That's right. Start. Uh, smite from this guy. Mm -hmm. oh, almost a big smite. Uh, D3. One. So take four. Uh, he's gonna put his pistols in here. Four shots. Uh, we'll turn this one into a six. Uh, that explodes into here. Uh, and then these are strength five, so fives. So only two mortal wounds. All right, can't do anything about that. Uh, so that's them. All of these guys are just going to put all the flames into there. All right. So we got two, four, five, six still. Two, four, six. Real, real high. Real high. The dome. That's pretty fucking high. That's pretty good. 10, 20, 4, 26. We got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26. And then how many more? 12 more. 12 more. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Alright, I do one on fives though. Yep. So here we go, boy. I'm gonna do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven minus twos, sir. You know, I think he's in trouble. <laughs> hey, my guy got shot off the table too. It's true. By a lot. <laughs> By a lot. Five, ten, eleven. All right. I need threes. I need to pass all but one of these. I do not at all. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh. Such well, Ah, uh, that would be cool, but okay. no. Well, both of our melee monsters got shot off the table, so I think I think it's fair. Yeah, I think so too. Okay, so they're done. Uh, that might definitely help. Mm -hmm. Uh, done, done, done. He pistoled. Oh, his shots. So we're gonna put uh, all of the flamers. How many wounds do these guys have? Uh, they have uh, one, two, four. Four wounds. So we're gonna put all the flamers in here. Okay. So we got three. I said. Three, it's actually four. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, wounding on probably threes. Uh, Captain's five, so threes. Give me one, two, three. All right. Three minus two. All right. So we're going to have to do this 
one at a time. Uh, first on this uh, guy with the apron, because he matters to the... No, it'll have to be on these three guys. And two of them die. Alright. Uh, so let's go to charges. Um, Theme Prince is going into... I should have charged that guy into the... This guy's going into both. Okay, go ahead. Got it. Got it. We're gonna stay toe in the dents. Mm-hmm. Um it mean, doesn't help you. She is going into them. Go ahead. Eight. So I'm well within nine. Right. So we're gonna go four to there. Mm-hmm. Five, six, seven, eight. Be within one inch. Son of a bitch. All right. Well, I'm going to check with you about that one. Were you going to overwatch? I was going to overwatch if it was a demon prince. Okay. So now demon prince going in. Mm -hmm. You got it. So demon prince going in right here. Uh, we're just going to get rid of them. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. These guys are... These guys are going to charge in. Okay. Take out you guys. Seven. That's a going in. So that tank. Five. Mm -hmm. So we're going five, five, and then just kind of scooch in this way. Uh, so you pile in, pile in. Uh, they're based, so pile in, pile in. Yeah, and there are two. They killed a guy. <laughs> Brent killed a guy. Stabbed in this trident. <laughs> uh, I think it's all my charges. Alright. Yes, so you can't interrupt, so we're gonna start um, just over here. We're uh -huh. gonna put a. I've never actually attacked the fucking Eldrick. Yeah. He just dies. So I think he has five attacks. He gets plus one to hit uh, for fly models, uh -huh. which the bikes are, but I'll minus one to hit because of my bracket. Weapon skill is a four plus. So he's got five attacks, one, two, three onto the bikes, uh -huh. and two onto the uh, low guys. All right. So hitting on uh, fours, threes. So two hits. Strength is seven. Strength is seven. So you need threes. How about give me one minus two. So one five up. Two damage. I take two damage, right? So this guy will die. And then the other two attacks, hitting on uh, fours. Uh huh. One hit. One hit. One wound. Minus right. two. Uh, and a move. Uh, and a move. He survives. Alrighty. Uh, and then he's fine where he is. Mm hmm. Uh, oh, sorry, you mind? He's gonna charge him. Uh, you go ahead. Where is he going? Who's he charging? Into the tank. Well, I guess I'm going to spend the TV. Okay. Well, <laughs> I was just showing him the dice. <laughs> ah, yeah, isn't that just exciting? I'm <sighs> so excited. All right, let's see if he gets in. All right, he got it. You got it. Scabush. All right, cool. So uh, I already used my thing this turn, so he's just going to have to roll it out. Uh, he's got two, four, six attacks. Uh, hitting on twos, one six, so that's two mortals, and then no other six. So that explodes into here, and then uh, strength is seven, so fives. Uh, one at minus three, so one minus three. All right, so one, uh, four up. All right, yeah. so just two mortals. All right, he's at five. All right, we'll pile into the other two. Uh-huh. And just chill. Right, so these guys are going over here. I'm gonna base this thingy. Uh, they got four, eight, that. So hitting on threes. Hitting on threes. And then wounding on fives. Whoa! Give me two minus two. 
factors. I'm outside of the range for my bullshit ability, so uh, the uh, he's dead. All right, does he blow? Up? Give me a six. Uh, no. Okay. So then they'll pile in. Um, they're gonna pile in. So they're gonna pile in and tag this thing. And keep the chain going. Uh, over here, she's going to pile in. One, two, she's not gonna pile in. He's gonna go. He's gonna go. And then he's just gonna do two, four, six. Uh-huh. Uh, so... Hitting on twos? Hitting on twos. What do you mean? Give it to me. Uh, yes. Hitting on twos. Cool. All right. So one goes in. And then uh, probably winning on twos. What's the strength? I'll look it up. It's either eight or nine. Uh, one. Oh, well, either, either way, it's three. So uh, AP is three, I think. AP three. Give me a six up. No, I didn't get a six up. Three damage. Three damage. I yeah. will. I will take it on this guy right here. He has one left because he has four wounds. This guy over there. Yep. Okay. So the reason why is because these guys have a rider on the back, so they get an extra wound. It's cool. kind of like an attack bike. Uh, let's go. Um, roll your uh, your claw. All right. Malefic. One. Two. Good to go. Okay. Uh, she is going to pile in. Yeah. And she'll do, I think she has five or six attacks. What's her toughness? Third toughness is five. One. One. One minus two. Takes it, and he dies. Okay, so I'm going to have to go over there, because I don't feel like giving you any extra movement with those cultists. Cool, so we piled in, uh, killed all them, uh, now I kept these guys on the objective just because they're off to try and uh, stop them from getting that, um, and yeah, so he's just piling three inches everywhere. And then he's going to fight with his bikes, and then that bike, and then those guys, and then give me some more else. Alright, well now I'm going to do the uh, puppy part. Uh, and that is going to be, I'm going to fight this guy next. Got it. He actually can kill your character. Cool. Got it. Right, three attacks. Hitting on... Hitting on... Hitting on threes. Okay, he's not going to kill the character. Uh, one AP minus three. Nice. Uh, six. So one is AP minus two. Five. Good. Um, nothing. And then uh, these two other idiots <laughs> onto the uh, the hell drake. So the iron can assist it and has two attacks. Uh, one, no AP. Into the hell drake. Into the hell drake. Three is. Nope, takes it. Aha. <laughs> and then uh, the bike. And then uh, this, uh, this little joke. He'll hit. He'll wound, one no AP. Oh yeah. Oh, this is good. <laughs> Hell's Drake's dying. Oh, shit. Shoot, that's the manipulator arms. Okay, two more attacks. Sorry. One more save. Good. Alright, uh... I'll take it. Cool. And now the, uh, the bike will make his four attacks onto, uh, your character. Then force. Give me two more, no AP. Takes one. Yeah. And then uh, those motorcycles. Alright, now bring him in. Actually, I can. <laughs> he can replace his base now. I can replace his base. <laughs> 
Do they have a fallback to shoot strat? They do, but I think it's two CP, so uh, basically they don't. Got it. Alright, I'm gonna... Yeah, without the crown, bro, I think this is really CP hungry. <laughs> it is. It's so weird. I'm gonna put all five onto your, um, uh, your little character. So we have three, six, and twelve. I'm just gonna get him in half an inch. There you go. Okay. Twelve, thirteen attacks. Sweet. I think she's a five up. I gotta check. All right, cool. So four wounds on my demon. Uh, she's a five up save in combat. So here we go. Get one of them, or three of them. That's fine. Well, I'll, ta I'll take one. Shit. <laughs> go down to three. Alrighty. Uh, so I got. That's a pretty good gun. Oh, your tank. Who do you want to go? Oh, my tank is gonna have to slap the uh, demon X. Got it. He's got D six attacks because he's a five uh, wounds. Uh, he's, got he's got one attack. Look at that. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Uh, so we got two for holding the center. Mm -hmm. uh, we got two for stealing or long war. Uh, we killed this. He wasn't on the objective. They went on the objective. Uh, we didn't kill anybody on that objective. Was the bike no? Was the bike on the objective? T touching the, the Drake. Uh, the bike was, but they're not dead yet. All right, give me some morales. So these guys are minus uh, one, two, three. Okay. So they're minus three, and then you lost one, so minus four. Okay, so I, uh, I need to roll hopefully a four or lower. I'm good. Okay, and then your what's their leadership? Uh, his leadership may be you didn't lose anybody who actually counts. Oh, so these two don't count? Uh, yeah, the two little guys don't count, now. Okay, so that doesn't matter. Um, and then they only lost... They lost one. All right, so it's minus one because of him. Uh-huh. Minus one because of him. Minus two because of uh, the four. Night Lords, and then minus one because you lost a guy. Right. Right? So uh, I and roll two dice. I need a three. Fast. And then roll again because you're. Okay, so I get to. I get to re-roll. So it doesn't. Matter. So I failed. All right. So one dice. One dice. I'm sorry. Yeah, one dice. One runs away. And then you're minus ones and twos, and threes because you count as being half strength. Okay. Hold on, hold on. So ones and twos, because you count as being half strength. Uh -huh. One more because of night lords, and uh -huh. one more because of uh, demons. Okay. <laughs> so ones, twos, threes, and fours. Alright, it's two die. Only two die. I'll take, uh. I need. I'll take this normal guy. And. I will take the searchlight. Got it. Alright. Uh. Yeah, I think that's, uh. I think that's it. Cool. So, uh. I got one over there. I held the center. Um, I got two for Long War, and that was it. So we're back at the top of turn four, or turn three, turn four, turn four. All right, sir, what did we do? All right, so uh, first I, I moved the uh, hearth guard in such a way that I can get this character closer to them, for some of them, uh, and then what I'll try to, because what I'm gonna try to do is kill her with, with, their, uh, with their shooting. If I get enough sixes, I'll be able to just dunk her, and there won't be anything she can do. I move these guys up uh, so that they can all shoot the imprints, since he's the closest ignoring her. I put, I fell back these uh, these bikes and I put them into the cover. They're going to be 12 inches away from this objective if I need to, well, if, if I can, uh, and they won't be able to be shot by his uh, flamers because they'll be very bad. At I fell back the, uh, the the pioneer so that he's in. Uh, range of this objective. Uh, what this will let me do is because he's got OPSEC take the objective from you. I also fell back uh, the character because I don't want him dying. I'm going to heal this uh, tank up by four. And I uh, will um, use my once per game ability to uh, uh, use the uh, top bracket uh, stratagem for zero points because I just remembered that on the data sheet. That's great. This some absolute yes. dumb stuff that uh, it's good to forget. This this guy has like six special rules. Oh, the the do with the character. The character, yeah. yeah. Um, I just think it's cool that his little guys don't count as yeah combat. So the one thing though is that the, the cogs, the little guys, they also don't benefit from any special rules. Uh, so if I rolled a six to hit the hell drake, it would have not benefited from the judgment tokens. Uh, but he does have two cute little arms. I am kind of sad that the guy with the revolver is dead. But what are you gonna do? I guess get better. 
So, uh, th I'm gonna go into my shooting phase. This character is the closest target, so I'm gonna uh, yeehaw his ass. With who? He's the closest target to him. Oh, got it. Uh, so I'm going to put the, um, doesn't have an invulnerable save. Nope. So I will go ahead and put the big gun here, and then the rest into the demon nuts. What's the AP on the big gun? Big gun is AP three. Okay, I do have an auto six, potentially. Potentially, auto six. Okay, so uh, I'll put the auto cannon into him. Is he, what's his mark? Just uh, slash. Slash. Okay, forgetting the auto. Oh, which way's first? Yeah, I'll put the auto cannon into him, and then the uh, the four bolts into them. Got it. Uh, so uh, I'm going to start off. I'm going to spend one CP, and I'm going to automatically hit with uh, the, sh the the conversion beam, and then I'll uh, roll to see if this this needs a three to hit. They both hit. So then I need uh, two spoons to strength nine. Good. And I have uh, two and AP minus three. So two AP minus. Three. What's the damage? Four. Nice. Yeah. So it won't matter. Uh, auto cannon shots are lost, and that's okay. Eight shots. I seem to always get my executioner dead. <laughs> I mean, he did. He did work. Oh, well, because if, if the demonette is touching the vehicle, you can't shoot at him. Right. So I, I think I did that against Guard and Jack, and Jack shot him because he wasn't the closest target. Uh, so uh, six hits onto the uh, ladies, one of which goes through. Mm -hmm. So give me six uh, four up saves on the demon nuts. Uh, one, two, three, die. Three die. Shot. Can't shoot. Can't shoot. Uh, we're going to shoot the hearth guard. I will. He's not uh, flying anymore. Correct. So I've got two in range of him. So I'm going to put two here. Remember, he's not in flying anymore. Right, but he's still the aircraft. But I thought this ignores it. It's uh, so because it's the aircraft keyword, mm -hmm. and he doesn't lose that. Mm -hmm. Got it. Uh, so two will go here, three will go in the deal. This is this is Alright, so uh, onto him. Does he gain the forest or no? Uh, no. Also, because it's the keyword and not like something like supersonic. Sorry. Uh, so sixes will go through. Bottom of turn three, I have it there. That's three to hit. Was and then uh, fives. Oh, okay. So, so two at AP three. On the big guy? On the big guy. Two AP three. Take one. Alright, does it work? Okay. Good. And then, uh, three on the demon prince. Ten shots. Actually, these dice, these dice make me feel a little better. <laughs> and now I have to be incredibly careful with how I roll them because, uh, I decided to get picky. So, uh, threes, a roll of a five or a six will automatically Okay. That's spicy. Then fives, because it's strength five. So give me six saves at AP three. So he has a four before. Yep. Ba ba. Dead. <laughs> yeah. Ba ba. Is he your warlord? Uh, probably. One of the three characters you've already killed. One of the four characters you've already killed is not worth it. Fair. Alright, um... And then I'll just take her off. You can just take her off. I'm just gonna put everything into her. Yeah, makes sense. Alright, so 15 for assassinate. Pretty good. What else? Any charges? Uh... It's 
it's actually an incredibly high chance that I pass this charge and screw myself out of holding that objective. So I'm, going to, <laughs> I'm just not going to charge. Okay. They can pile in a uh, six as well, which is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Uh, all right, so I guess I'll go with the demonettes. Yep. So they're just gonna pile in. Uh, pile in. Uh, so this chick will die. Pile in. Pile in. Ouch. Pile in and pile in. Uh, she won't pile in. So we basically got one chick that's gonna die. I oh, know, then they get to consolidate again. My bad. So uh, we got one, two, three. So one. All right, so hitting on uh, threes. Uh, wounding on. I think sixes. I don't think you're tough. I don't think you're trying to buy that. No, only four. So give me two minus two. Two, three ups. Good to go. Right. And then she'll pile in just to get in coherency. Mm -hmm. And that's it. All right. Text back. Uh, I'll put D6 uh, onto the uh, demonettes. Two, six. Oh, yeah. Give me two saves. Two die. Okay. Uh. Kill five. I have to look up their leadership. It's, I think it's an eight. So they run and then uh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Two more die. So one and two. All right, cool. So we're back after bottom turn four. So found out there's not a lot to do when your character's dead. Uh, these guys fell back on the objective just to give you two points in the center. Mm -hmm. um, these guys advanced over to here to try and finish off uh, these guys on the objective. Um, they uh, moved over, they all moved over. I don't know if I'm going to try and kill the tank or just go after the character and keep the tank in combat. I haven't decided yet. Uh, and that's me. So second part phase, we're going to do warp time over here. Is a 11. So I, think, I think you pass. We're going to scooch up another six inches. Sounds good. Get a bunch of them in the cover. Also, as a note, he uh, he spent a CP to get these raptors at, into the sky. Yeah, so one CP, I put him up one more turn, so I'm just like, come down somewhere over there to do uh, the last uh, banner. Uh, and then let's go to shooting, because we don't have any more psychers. Uh, they're just going to put all the shots in there. All right, sounds good. So we got uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. We got ten. Uh, the toughness is six. And then, uh, All right. So, winning on fives. Minus twos. All right. So I have my 13 dice here. I'm going to want to start on one of the guys in cover, but then I don't want to do any more cover saves. Actually, at this point, it doesn't even matter. So I'm going to do start with both the guys in cover. So three ups, because it's plus two, minus two. All right. So one guy's dead. One guy. Time. Boom, 
left. One, good, dead, and then these are all four ups. Cool. All right, uh, and then no more shots, so we're just gonna get some charges going. Uh, those guys are gonna charge here. All right. I'm not gonna try to do anything about it. Got it. Got him. Got him. Let's go with. Uh, they're gonna charge the uh, the tanky. Mm -hmm. Got it. Uh, demonets are going to charge the uh, the tank. They can fall back and charge. No, they can't. Um, so you have one CP to just try and roll sixes, right? That's it? Yeah. All right, we're going to charge the tank. Mm -hmm. You want to do it? Uh, no. Okay. No, I'm going to spend it for something else. Got so, it. So, so five. I need to hold on to my CP, too. <laughs> All right, uh, we'll start, I guess, over there somewhere. Probably one. Uh, no. So the reason why, why Derek wants to go with this first is because if he kills the character, I can't use, any, use the, uh, the character's rule to keep the, um, the land fortress from dying. Good man, sixes. Uh, and then strength is five. Your toughness five. So four three. Um, um, minus five right now. Minus five leadership. One two three. Minus four leadership. Minus four. Yeah. Then yeah, that's, that's good enough. Bring me leadership five. What's your toughness? Toughness is five. So four threes. Threes. So look at that. Look at that. Three. Whoops, check. They live. All right. They will probably live. All right. So uh, eight piece two. Little idiot. Uh, he's good. Little idiot. He's good. All right, this is gonna be kind of dumb. All right, little idiot dies. Oh no, he's got his little arms. Yeah, you're gonna want to probably put him in. Uh, over here, back of his base. Mm -hmm. Good to go. Yeah. Okay. okay. I try. I you try. Did. You did try. It was a good try. So he's not going any. That tank's not going anywhere. Uh, they're gonna go. Mm-hmm. Eight, ten. I need fives. He's probably in trouble. Very much in trouble. It's dead. Okay. Alright, so uh, this guy has three tanks. Needs threes. Uh, give me uh, two saves at uh, AP2. Yep. One guy, uh, three. And then two attacks. And give me one at no AP. Yep. Good to go. Thank you. Uh, D6 attacks, five attacks. They're all going on to the uh, squad that's on the, the cover, on the, on the objective. Give me one save. Good to go. Alright, so what's their leadership? Uh, their leadership is eight. Alright, they don't get the leech trade, so nope. Mm. 
So I'll get long war. Uh, I killed one, mm -hmm. two, three. I think that's all I killed on the objectives. Wait, don't you need to kill units? I've killed that unit. Right. Oh yeah, three from the. Uh, sorry, by so your counting how many? Took the objective and then killed that. So mm -hmm. that's three. I can kill the center. That's two. Mm -hmm. uh, war purge was done. Uh, battlefield units should be next turn. Mm -hmm. So your turn, you'll hold one. So you get four. Oh, this is top five. So you get four. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. All right, cool. So, scoot it up. Scoot it up on the objective. Ran over, stole this objective. Uh, is, do you have to roll on this at all? Like, what, what does that do? And does that stay on or no? Does that go off? Uh, so, uh, it stays on. I don't have to roll. The roll at the, at the end of the turn will be to determine if I uh, yeah, can uh, get an extra uh, point from it. And I was smart enough to keep the scanner alive, so, uh, so we are going good for me. <laughs> but I'm going to keep this guy in combat because hopefully he can kill the uh, the possessed with his three attacks. Um, if I can get a, uh, an actual six to wound on, he'll be dead. Uh, and uh, my goal is to uh, shoot them off. Or at least shoot them most of the way off, most of the way off, because I got three guys on there, and then charge the uh, demonettes to uh, try to score three points off of him. Seems good. And uh, yeah, so uh, we're gonna open up with probably the most important thing. I'm going to shoot the hearth guard into your your river queen. Now, because you have the one guy, over, the two guys over here, I'm not gonna get the minus one to hit. Mm -hmm. However, I am going to spend one CP. Uh, for ancestral uh, judgment. Is that the re rolls? That's the re rolls. Nice. Alright. So all the sixes do mortals? All the sixes do a mortal. Nice. And then the, the sequence ends. Nice. Uh, it is a very, very dumb gun to have <laughs> on a 45 point per model unit. That can teleport. That can teleport. Did you wipe the squad? Uh, I don't think I did. One, two, three, four guys dead. Now all the fours, the fives, and the sixes, or all the fours and the fives, they're going to turn into, uh, they're going to turn into wounds. So I just need to roll. Because they have the, uh, so these are the strength five, so I need four to wound because of your upgrade. So I need you to give me nine saves, presumably two ups. We're gonna take, uh, so can I kill these guys with the mortal wounds? Uh, that'll be afterwards, so. Uh, so we'll start with them. So two, four, uh, how many, six, eight, nine? nine. So nine, nine, uh, three ups. Okay. So, oh no, it's one damage, right? Yes. It's so one it goes damage. back down to two ups. Yeah. So twos. So one guy dies. Sweet. Uh, ignore the first one. Sweet. And then he takes that. So one, two, three, four, five die. Because of the mortal ones. Mm -hmm. So we got one, two, three, four, and five. The amount of firepower out of this little unit is yeah. awesome. Um, yeah, yeah. The auto wounds it just goes straight through the uh, you know minus one to wound stuff. Even if I gave him uh, plus one toughness, so it doesn't matter. No, because it would bring them to toughness five. So yeah. Basically, I'm going to be fishing for force. Alright, so it wounded me 31 times, and I roll four ones. So, they died. Yeah. I have 35 shots, 31 went through. Not a single three. <laughs> all fours, which all auto wound. Cool, which so that took that over, so that's good. Yep. Alright, and then, um, 
this tank is going to shoot at them. Got it. Now, oh, real quick, let's do the, the jerk for, uh, he'll heal for three. He doesn't heal for four this time because he killed all the little moves. He's never going to die. No, he's not. It's all right. I just need them to fall back and take these two objectives. Uh, so, three. Look at that. Look at that. Good job. Twos. So give me nine saves on the beats. Four. Two damage. Beats. Uh, fours. Oh, I did it. I was like, uh, one dead, two dead, three dead. Uh, two. Oh, Is that it? Um, yeah. Right, cool. Charges. Uh, charges. So, take it away. The hearth guard are going to charge those two DNFs. Yep. Got it. And I do like that. So, uh, yeah. Right, so, we're going to go eight. Yeah, most likely. Right. All right. Uh, there are no other charges. They're going to sit there happy. They're going to sit there very happy. And uh, I'm going to roll my attacks on these demon these because it does matter. So, seven guys. Seven guys. Seven guys. You can still pile in and stuff. Okay, what am I thinking? Pro moves. Still, eight guys. But I don't think I'll need that. Yeah. And then I want to get is. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the, the pro move. What is up there, bags? So hopefully you enjoyed that battle report. It was definitely a fun game. Uh, biggest thing that I took away from the game, uh, we didn't. I recorded the last input on you know what they or what Craig would have done different, what I would have done different, and uh, it didn't it didn't set it like something happened to the recording, so it got deleted and whatever it may be. So I'm going to talk to you about what happened at the end of the game. I do have a picture of the score so that way we can go over and kind of see what we liked about the list what we didn't like about, like about the list uh, and kind of go over our thoughts okay so here, here was the final matchup uh he wins by nine uh votan so Vant votan took the score uh he had control one control two so craig had 35 for primary prospects of the wealth he had nine out of 15 no prisoners he had a 10 uh, and assassinate he killed all my characters so that was awesome killing it turn one uh or Turn two for him, uh, killing the master possession. That was just a fuck up. I again completely forgot that you can actually teleport that unit. Uh, I had thirty four for primary, so we just missed out by one on the primary. Uh, Warp ritual. We only had seven because he killed all of our uh, all, all of our characters. Long war. We we squeaked out with a seven, and then retrieve battlefield data. We had twelve. Uh, so the biggest thing that we took away was I think turn three we talked about it yeah so I think turn two we left that one guy who wasn't on the center objective that like I think it was off by maybe half an inch and if he was on the center objective we would have had uh, 12 
on that one turn. Uh, and we would no, we would have kept him to an eight instead of a twelve, so that's four points. And then we would have got a twelve the next turn, and we missed out on the two points in the in the center. So, I think turn, two, yeah, this turn. So where where he got a twelve at, um, that should have been eight. So that would have been uh, seventy five, seventy four, and then I would have had two on that turn. On turn two, so that would have been seventy seven. I don't know, whatever maybe. So that, that one fuck up you guys saw in the center, uh, make sure that you have your models in, in all the places. Uh, and I did mess up the master of possession. Like he always, not, not mess, I mean, he obviously died cause, cause Greg hopped over and just shot the shit out of him. But I meant the uh, master of execution. So he always dies in combat with a tank because I always forget to put base to base contact with a, a, a unit. So that way he can't be targeted because still look out, sir. So next game, I'm going to be playing this list uh, at R RTT coming up. So I'm going to be using the same list. I'm taking out the um, uh, dragon. So I'm taking out the Heldrake and I'm going to be adding in a, a unit of warp talents as well as I believe a spawn. So one spawn, one warp town. The spawn's there to kind of give me the minus one uh, aura if I need to run him somewhere, uh, camp on objective, or um, have a charge target. So instead of like my possessed charging in first, I could have my spawn charge in first, uh, get stop the overwatch or they overwatch my spawn who the hell cares uh and then the other unit charges in so that's gonna be my combo warp towns i want to deep strike them in either come in turn one and kind of put them on a far objective uh put a banner down so that way they're kind of threatening that zone because they move 12 uh or just deep strike uh and do the same thing we did here with the um what was it retrieve battlefield data actually that that worked out pretty well for me um long war i'm not sure if, if we'll if we'll keep long war uh, and warp ritual so maybe warp ritual banners and retrieve battlefield data i think battlefield data and banner might be the same i don't know we'll figure it out but hopefully you guys enjoyed it uh craig liked his list uh, he's going to be running that at the next rtt but we're, we're going to be coming up a lot of uh, 10th edition stuff coming up there's not going to be a lot of stuff to talk about in 9th edition coming up anymore it's really just uh this video um uh, G, uh, RTT video for Black Legion and uh, I think maybe one or two more battle reports but everything else really is going to be moving forward into the 10th edition so let me know on Discord if you guys are going to go check that out uh, and also if you guys are interested uh, we're selling Dirtbag Dice that's up on Discord as well it's a dollar each they're fucking sick uh, and then the stickers we send them out with the dice if you guys are interested in getting some stickers and objective markers provided to you guys from 3D6 Wargame that guy is fucking awesome uh, runs a great company so guys appreciate it good luck and we'll see you in another video soon. All right, so we spent one CP to get uh, full rerolls to hit on this guy. Uh, we hit five times, uh, wounded three times. Mm -hmm. Yes, three times. Uh, plus one to wound. So, your attacks next? Uh, this isn't going to matter much. So, I'm going to activate him. Good. I am going to spend this last CP mm -hmm. uh, for rerolls to hit. Okay. And then I have, uh, I need fours. Look at that, one move. AP? Uh, AP is two, so you're good to go. Cool. All right, uh, so these guys will go. Mm -hmm. 